Hey, 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 everybody. Welcome to episode three of Stonopolis. Hey. Or, as my window uh, <laughs> likes to call it, Stonopolis Beta. Isaac, oh. this is a beta pack. Wow, is that just so, you insulting so, 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 it? You, the, yeah, <laughs> you yeah, the yeah. I, it it's, a beta? Uh, I'm Nick Alpha, ah. and this is Stonopolis <laughs> Beta, made by B Ben Law Sigma. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, Ben is definitely Alpha. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, why yeah. his name is the pack beta, right? Yeah, yeah, he's he's yeah, showing he's, dominance over the paint. Exactly, exactly. Got sense. nothing to do with the release version or anything. No, 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 no. That'd be that'd be that'd be silly. That would be ridiculous, yeah. Isaac. To be honest, frankly. Well, what do you think of those people who call it a, a beta? They'll say beta instead of. Oh like yeah, beta. beta, beta. I think when I was a kid, I used to say beta. Yeah, yeah that doesn't um, surprise me. Yeah, and then and then, but yeah. And then I don't the, know. the world, the world crushed that out of you. Uh, it because, crushed my hopes and dreams. Yeah, yeah because it's not it, the right way to say it. <laughs> it formed, it formed the norms, and it it molded me, Isaac. Right. Um, you like being yeah. molded. Yeah, I do. That's why. <laughs> that's why I call it. <laughs> that's why I call it beta now. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, fair enough, yeah. man. Fair enough. You like to, you like to, you just, you just conforming, man. You know, it's, it's fine. Exactly, exactly. I'm being a good boy. Yeah. Okay. Which is it's, anyone it's who's listening. Yeah. I'm being a good boy. Nick's being a good boy. Okay. No need to look okay, into his, his, his personal affairs. Okay. Please. He's being good. Please no. Please no. <laughs> <laughs> so we've just got our uh, blood ultimate, and we upgraded it to tier yeah. two at the end of the yeah. last episode. I'm quickly whipping up some, uh, some. I'm turning some mini charcoal into mini coal. Using the uh, the blood altar here, and then that's going to allow us to make oh, actual actual coal, coal. actual yeah. real life coal, real life full fat, fully fledged, robust coal. Yeah, not not diet coal or coal zero. Yeah, this is coal full light. fat coal. No. This is yeah, coal, yeah, coal yeah, good, good, go. good. Boom. And so it looks like we're going to make a, a coke oven at some point and use that coal to make coal. Oh, that seems pretty straightforward. So I'm wondering, we got a couple of things to do here, man. I kind of want to know. So we we want to tr try out this uh, this little like rooting setup from from yes. One Magic Flight and figure out how that works. Yeah. But I'm also thinking we probably sooner rather than later want to get this dagger of sacrifice because the dagger of sacrifice is going to allow us to uh, use the life of mobs instead of the life of us to mm. uh, to fill up the blood altar, right? Because currently mm -hmm. we have to take the sacrificial dagger and we get like 200 uh, life point millibuckets for every little right click, right? Yeah. Which is fine, but if we do this and put the dagger itself into the blood altar, we can turn it into this dagger of sacrifice. And now, if we can get like a mob on top of the altar and we kill the mob, that will put life points into the altar instead mm. of us having to give up our own life points for it. The tricky part, I guess, is like getting mobs here. Acquiring game them, yeah, acquiring the mobs themselves. Do we have any like vector plates? I don't see any vector plates. Like any fans? Like a mob pusher, maybe? We don't. We've got like the um. We've got industrial foregoing, so we can get like a mob duplicator, but I think that's gonna be way, 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 way further down. Later on, in the, yeah. In the pack's life cycle, yeah. I do wonder if there's a, an easier way for us to get mobs to spawn on top, because obviously we could dig a dark room somewhere, right? Exactly. It's a bit, um, it's a bit old school, isn't it? It's a one dot twenty mod pack, <laughs> people. I want some new school methods. Yeah, where's the where's the the, the mob spawning stick, Ben? Exactly. That allows us to spawn exactly. a mob at the, at the right click yeah. of the stick. Okay? <laughs> ben, next update? Question mark. <laughs> this is beta, after all. Yeah, you get you get to me. You get to me. The, yes, please, Ben. The next quest line is called Friends. Oh, there's a summoning block. <laughs> <laughs> no, there you go. <laughs> yeah, the next Never quest mind, line is, is called Friends here, and the top quest there, man, is a summoning block. It says the summoning block can be used to spawn some mobs. Press U on the summoning <laughs> block and JEI. Well, that's the useful, isn't mobs it? That can be spawned. <laughs> that's also uh, useful to spawn our skeleton to acquire a bone to get the sound of money yeah. from their previous quest. Okay, so we need a, a a bucket with blood in it, basically. Yeah, um, I see that. And then some other other. We need three void ingots, which is fine. We can just smelt those. And we need five bronze. I assume the bronze we're going to make in the alloy kiln with copper and tin. So we need six copper and two tin annoyingly because it's uh, you make four bronze at once, which means we've got to do it in two batches to get five. Right. So six copper and, and two tin, which means we need a lot of copper nuggets is the thing. Yeah, right? I've got five and that's, got that's seven. clearly not enough. I've got seven okay. copper nuggets. Um, so that's one ingot. How do we get an so orange far. sapling? An orange sapling is copper dust. Copper dust is a copper ingot. Because if we can get three copper ingots, man, we can turn copper, we can put them in the strainer with the purified water. We can get copper dust. Four copper dust gets us a copper sapling. A copper sapling 
then gets us like copper leaves. Hold on. Yes, it gets us copper leaves. Copper leaves we can put into a strainer with life essence as the water source, and that gets oh us copper Lord. nuggets, like ultimate. Right. Right, 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 right. I see. I so see. So we just need like three copper ingots, four copper ingots to get okay. enough copper to make unlimited copper using the, the strainer. But then the trouble there is that we also need to get the life essence onto the ground. For that, we need a bucket. And I think for the bucket, we're going to have to make a copper bucket or like a bronze. Yeah, so even bucket. more uh, copper required for that. Yeah, we need three copper for the copper bucket, at which point that's seven copper. We could just go ahead and make the the the, the summoning block at that point, right? But I, it, it's probably right, worth I see, doing I see. the copper automation bit first. Yes. That would make sense. Yeah. Um, so let I me think... spread out this smelting then. So we get these old void nuggets quicker. And then let's see how far we can't get. Okay. How many a. void nuggets do we have? Do we have any, any of that? I've, I've in got here? 30 on oh, me. Which 30 makes, void nuggets? Uh, 30 void nuggets. I took them out of the, uh, oh, the furnace. Can you throw them at me, man? Oh, I've just turned them into... Well, I've turned them into ingots, but you can always turn them back. Oh, yeah. Because I need them in nugget yeah. form for the... Yeah, you can. Nice. There you go. There's four ingots there. Cool. So I guess actually, real quick then, like slight, slight diversion. Let's um, let's look at this automation thing then, um, because like I could stand here and do this right, where I put this in and then I wait and yeah, I take it out. But wait. like, you know, what's yeah. the, where's the fun in that? So exactly. We can make a rooting stick if we put a stone stick into the altar with 150 life. Points. So a stone. Oh, I've got stick. one. Here we go. Oh yeah. Yeah. Look, nice. There it is. There's the rooting stick. I think we need more. That. I think we need a few of these, man. Okay. Uh, so, okay. I'll put my other one in. Then. Yeah. Go for it, man. Nice. There you are. Classic. Oh, whoops, I put that in. That's not right, but that's fine. We can use it anyway. <laughs> so that's the rooting stick. Then there's the, the nerd router, which is two rooting sticks and a void ingot. That's fine. I can craft some of these nuggets back into the void ingot. So boom, boom, yeah. boom. There's my uh, nerd router. Good. Not to be confused with your home router. Then, no, no. So the master rooting node here, it says, the heart of your soul network, one per network, all nerds must be tracked back to this. Okay, so this is two sticks, two mixed stone ingots. How are we doing on mixed stone, man? Um, not great to be honest. I've got one mixed stone ingot. I've got sixty-four nuggets actually, which turns into a fair few ingots. So yeah. I can get you eight ingots off the fly here if you'd like okay. these. Yeah, could I have those? Here you go. Yeah, we need more. We we might need more though. Let's have a look. So that let me type in nerd. I can make the master nerd with two more blank slates the blank slates were the void chunks here we go one two lovely and then over here that is almost everything i think actually the, the wooden pop that i made earlier that's down here lovely and boom okay so i got a master rooting nerd okay okay but i think can i also need to consult ben's picture yeah that's, to get but, all of this we, we get free money just for looking at ben's picture man look at that Oh yeah, so good. How do you get you get this useful things as well, like these rooting extra rooting sticks and stuff like that? It's so good. Yeah, right. Okay, so I'm gonna make two more of these. Perfect. And then do I need do I need two for this or just one? I did need two for that. Okay, so I need one more one more void chunk. Again, we got loads in here. That's fine. The void chunks are not at all a problem. We've got so many of them. And so now, can I make the input and output? I think I can. I think I just need I need more rooting sticks. That's fine as well. Did you claim your oh, me chat? Did you claim your um your rooting stick reward, <laughs> I, I did, I did. Yeah, here you go. Okay, lovely. There you are, you can have that. Uh, also, do you have any more stone? Like, to make more stone sticks? I with? don't, but I can go ahead and mine some. Um, That's okay. I think these, uh, yeah, these colored stones work. Perfect. You, you got it. Nice. I got it, I got it, I got it. We need a lot of these nice. sticks, man. Gosh, yeah, so input, rooting, output, and master. Gosh, it's like a freaking, we're setting up like a freaking mesh Wi-Fi network here, man. Yeah, right. Look at this, gosh. <laughs> God. Jeez. Do you um do you have a master a master router man? Is that what you call it? Yeah, that's just the name of my Wi-Fi network, Isaac. <laughs> yeah, master. To assert dominance <laughs> over everyone else is in my in my building. <laughs> the master yeah. network. Exactly. Fair master enough, network. Man. Do you have a yeah. do you have a do you have a quirky uh router name to because you know other people can see it? No, mine's very boring. Mine is just what? the uh default one was oh it's just like you know bt yeah. open wi-fi or whatever it, yeah you know, the exactly. or something. C connect to me exclamation mark <laughs> not a virus smiley face <laughs> yeah see i um i live uh, in a more rural area because I'm, I'm not you know i don't have uh, people checking them out regularly you can't but... see other people's networks yeah yeah, exactly. yeah. but you, you, you live in like a, in a apartment building right so there's people I do. Who, uh, be able oh, to, to check in on you all the time 
Yeah, I got my Wi-Fi settings. Freaking out! It's like looking through a bloody employee list, man, of Wi-Fi networks. <laughs> Uh, yeah. yeah, which is oh. uh, which is quite good. But what it does mean is that because because of that, I have very good Wi-Fi coverage in my entire home. Any uh, of them? Because my uh, home is not very big. Any of them open? Anyone there? Like, just not set any password on look. there? I'm gonna have a look right on now their, on their Wi-Fi. If just any of them, I, I, I'm intrigued if any of those have got. If, if any of your neighbours have bothered to put like a quirky name in on their on their Wi-Fi network. Okay, so to answer, so let's have a look. So one, two. Or is it just all the same? I've got I've got, I've got six Wi-Fi networks um, okay. that I can see, including mine. So five yep. others, uh, public ones. Anyway. Oh no, no, it's just refresh. Now I can see. Oh no, yours still going. Three, four, <laughs> five, say, six, six, seven, seven like eight, eight nine, ten, twelve. Isaac, twelve, okay. excluding mine. There we go. That's more like it. Across all kinds of different. Uh, sorry, thirteen now. Across all kinds of different <laughs> providers. Adding more fast than you can. Keep Honestly, up. <laughs> I've got E B T. Sky, Talk Talk, got all of them, and uh, Now TV, and one of them is unsecured. Oh. Isaac. Ooh, one person has not set a password. You got and only one of them is saying something different. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I should if, go in. I should... What have they, um, the one of them is, is, is it named anything quirky or is it just like, like Jenny's wife? No, it's a standard name. Oh, yeah, it's okay. a standard name. Yeah, from a, from a manufacturer, wow. unfortunately. Um, maybe it's there as a honeypot, man. Maybe they want me to connect to it. Yeah, probably. Um, yeah. Oh. Okay. Well, this is done. Um, I nice. got all the, all the router and nodes and stuff. Y yeah, I got all of them, or quite a lot of them, as rewards as yes. well, if you need more of these, which is great. Okay, so let's... I, I have no idea how this works, Nick. I'm running this on the fly. But, Good. Okay, uh, well, we're learning together then. Let's have a look then. So first of all, Nick, I am at half a heart, so I'm just going to chomp a little bit on this cooked... Uh, yeah, yeah. Pretty fly for a Wi-Fi. That's a good, uh, a good name. I like it. Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, okay, so we need an output and an input node down next to the the thing. So let's put the input here and the output here, and then presumably we have to use these item filters. So this is actually interesting. You can just right-click it. Do you have any of these, or did you give me these item filters? Uh, no, I've got all of these things. Here you go. Oh, yeah, sure. There you are. It's not like there anymore. Inventory space there already. They, they all stack. Perfect. Nice. Okay. So, presumably here, what we're trying to automate is copper nuggets, right? So, we're going to send in mm -hmm. the void nuggets. So, let me do a, a void nugget filter. So, I'll filter void nugget, I think. Did that? Nope, that didn't. I'll allow void, void nugget. Check. Did that? that <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to... Hold on. Input, filter, allow void nuggets all. So when I right-click the filter, it comes up with... Oh, no, this one is filtered. Okay. No, that's fine. Okay. So I try to click... Wait, oh, no, I can put it in. There we go. Okay, so that's filtered. Okay, good. Right. So let's put a chest here. And let's put... This is a... Which which one is this? Are you input or output? This one here is output. So if we put an input node up here... Presumably, this is going to pull from that chest. It doesn't look how Ben's looks, <laughs> but that's maybe fine. Yeah, then... he used a barrel, didn't he? So maybe that's why. Um, or maybe it will come off of like the skeleton mode once oh, it's been connected. connected those together. Okay, so if I put, okay. if I put like a void nugget in there, does that move over? No, it doesn't. <laughs> okay, <laughs> input barrel, output node. Routing node, allow void nuggets, quantity all. In here. These are both input? Are they both input? Oh, they are both input. That's my bad. I thought this was output. Ah. Uh. Hold on. Oops. Didn't need to break the altar either. That's fine. Thankfully, you don't lose anything there. Let me move this output then to this side. So if I link this, shift right click to this, that's linked. That still doesn't move anything over, which is maybe to be expected. That does have stuff inside of it. The good news is we do have the uh, the sanguine sentient, which I think is going to give us information about this if we need it. Uh, so okay. node router. The node router is used to link nodes together in a network. It, uh, it's functionally uh, its functionality sorry is straightforward. Simply hold left shift and right button while aiming at a <laughs> node. Then do the same to another node within 16 blocks. These two nodes are now linked. If you want to deselect a node, uh, right button on any other block. Okay, and then. What about this, uh, the, the master node thing? So let me go back to root rooting nodes. Hauling items around by hand may be all right for some people, but we are sanguimancer. We are a sang sanguine mensa, sanguimancer. 
What more? What's more? We have access to Demon Will. Surely there's a better way to go about this. As such, you've managed to come up with rooting nodes. These offer pow a powerful way to transport, sort, and filter items, sending them magically through the air as you decree. Rooting nodes, no, rooting node networks have three main components, inputs, outputs, and masters. Every network requires one master node. Okay, so I've got to put the master node somewhere. Let's put the master node, like, up on the, up on the roof or something, like up here. And then let's connect that to our pre-existing setup. So does that... It still doesn't move anything. Okay, that's fine. Baby steps. It's possible, actually, in here. Do I have to set it to... It's set to south. Is that the way that's facing? It is. So it knows where the, the machine is. And then I assume here this is set to north by default? It is, yeah. So it knows what it's doing. Okay. Do I have to change the quantity to one? And do I have to put this filter back in? Void nugget. It's possible I have to filter the input as well. Let me try that. Let me right. Take this. Let me do this. Let me put this in. And then we click here, maybe. So if I put that in here... There we go. Okay, hey, right. So nice. that kind of works. The, the problem with it, though, is that it's put all of them in. I want I want to quantify specifically one. Um, uh, yeah, I think you do that with the in this the output number. node. Yeah. I've done it on both. Hold on. If I put that back in, does that only do one? No, it does 16 again. <laughs> okay, right. Yeah, keep reading. Hold on. Let's keep reading. This is it. Story time. Uh, every network requires exactly one master routing node, and every other node in the network must be able to trace a route back to the master node, whether directly or via another node. Input and output nodes can withdraw or insert items from any block with an accessible inventory, respectively. The master routing node will be able to accept upgrades in the future, but for now it can only serve as a controller cat. That's fine. A master routing node is all well and good, but without the other two types of nodes, nothing will work. The input routing node draws items into the network. The output routing node exports them again, and plain, and plain old routing nodes serve to extend the reach of your network. That makes sense. As input and output nodes are currently otherwise identical, we will be focusing on the input nodes unless otherwise specified. Um, okay. When you place an input and output node down, it will automatically connect to all adjacent inventories, but won't do anything without a filter of some kind in at least one of its sides or slots. So you have to put a filter in to make it do anything. So you can set the filter to do nothing, but you have to have a filter in there. For example, you could use a standard item filter to set iron ore to the top of the furnace and a second filter to set coal to the bottom. Sure, that makes sense. And then you can configure the sides, north, south, east, and west. That makes sense. You can put the filter in. We've kind of figured that bit out. Is there a way? How do I limit the quantity, though? Because in here, it says um, at the bottom, there's like a little quantity slot, right? Oh, there's like a number, at least, that I change. Yeah. And that seems to, to change something. It says quantity one. We've got to change the top one to quantity all. Which, is that zero? <laughs> Hold on. Maybe it's in the filter. Everything. Deny, allow. No, it's not in the filter. That's fine. Hmm, I, yeah, I don't know how we set it to, to specifically move a certain quantity. Hmm. Over Sounds left, like... you'll see a space for us to insert a filter. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, that's just like a priority. So the number on the bottom uh... there is a priority. No, it's going to have one filter per side. Yeah, that's a, that's a quantity thing, not a, not a permanent thing. So presumably, though, there is a way to limit it to one item at a time. Because you can put them all in, but the trouble is that it, then it tries to do them all at once, and you need a lot more life points that we don't have. Yeah, I see that. I see that. Like, the, if you hover over the filter, it says all void colon nuggets. void nugget, nuggets, right? So is there a way to make this output one say one colon void nugget? Yeah, let's have um, a look. So, I mean, like, you can take the filter. I don't know how you would filter it to, to, to be one. Yeah, right? unless you just put it... Type one in where that hashtag yeah, is. Yeah, I, I, I just yeah, uh, yeah. Okay, no, I did exactly. Wow, look at that! Like, you've done it. You're a genius. Oh, brilliant! Nice. There we okay. go. Well, thanks, there you ben. go. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Ben. <laughs> so then, so there in we that go. Case, then, this should be pretty straightforward. We put yeah. We need another filter, I think, but we put an input node here then, and let's say we have another output node. We'll we'll mirror it. We'll do Ben's setup here. We'll put the uh, the chest like here, right? We'll put this here. So then we put our output node down, like this. And then we need, I need one more filter because I've only got one, I need two, which is just a wooden hopper in the smell tree. That's actually completely fine, Nick. Uh, hopper. Nice. Made of wood. Boom, boom. Okay, so I put that in here. Let me take those nug nuggets out first so this doesn't go crazy. Let's do this. And boom. Cool. So now we're going to have one filter that is set to pull the void nuggets, uh, the copper nuggets, that is right yeah out of here and then up here we're going to have basically the same filter right just for void for copper nuggets that goes yeah. in here so and then we need to connect everything to the same master line. yeah thing okay cool 
So now, I know you can't see this line on the, on your side, but like it looks kind of cool. I like the the blue laser that oh, like, yeah, you hover over the stream. the nerd. Like a yeah, neon yeah, like blue. A, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if I can, I wonder if I make a second one if you can see it. But um, if I put the void nuggets in now, they should move down, get turned into copper nuggets, and then get moved over into here. Presumably. Yay! Hey. Nice. Okay, and that's the ones I already had. To it. There we go. Good. good. Very good. Okay. Look at cool. that. So we learned, we learned something. Require you. <laughs> yeah, we learned something. We learned something. That's, that's pretty cool, actually. So it doesn't require you to put each nugget in at a time and go crazy, right? Yeah, just bingo. Just I mean, blooded up, basically. Yeah, exactly. Like, this wasn't strictly necessary. We could have done this without doing this, right? Like, we could have done it manually. But, uh, but now we know how it works, man. Exactly. Exactly. I quite like that. And what's what's more important than than knowing stuff? Exactly. Question mark. Question mark. <laughs> uh, <laughs> over that one. Uh, so we needed four copper, right? So four copper, yes. We're we'll not far a copper off sample. then. Okay, good. We're not far off. I think we need uh, what like uh, six more. Cool. Yeah, Come on, good. baby. And again, thankfully, it doesn't take that much life, that many life points, so it's all. all yeah. Good if it, God, if it took a thousand. That oh, would, it be, would be horrendous. It would be so bad. Yeah, that would be long. Okay, be thankfully, really thankfully, Ben's on our fun. side. It, it seems. Thanks, Ben. Thanks, Ben. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Thanks, man. But yeah, no, have a social relationship this... with Ben. Thanks, my bro. <laughs> <laughs> if we can get this, uh, this summoning block, Nick, I think we're, I think we're gonna be onto something, Ben. Yeah, yeah. This would if be it's good. gonna be easy enough for us to summon stuff. That's gonna be great. Yeah. Are you waiting for thirty-six here? Is that what you're after? Yes. I see. Yeah, you're pretty and... nice. And we got it. <laughs> Uh, orange nice. sapling, I think is what we're after. Yeah, so we need four copper dust, which is just four copper ingots inside of the uh, the strainer with the pink water. Okay, I will I'm gonna stop this then, that. making even more copper for now. Four copper copper dust, you say? Four copper dust. Four copper dust. Four cups of copper dust. Four cup copper dust. Four copper 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 dust. Copper copper dust. Oh yeah, copper, look at that dust. copper dust. It looks like bronze dust. Isaac, bronze dust. It's, it's so, uh, it's so, it's so bright. Look at this. Can I remove the filter? If I put, like, if, if I leave an empty filter in there, will it just pull anything? Or will it not do that? No. All right. Oh, okay, fine. So you do have there it is. Out. Okay, I guess you can filter multiple things though, right? Like this. Actually, and that, that way I can put these in, and that should still, should still work. Oh, but I also need to. I'll see to filter them on the input as well. Jeez, forget every time. Right. Yeah. You got uh, four a, copper dust. I need a sapling then, don't I? That's what this is all leading up to. Here we go. We use a black one because we've got absolutely loads. Oh, yes. Go get, get my head oh, around this. Oh, yes. Uh, one. Look at this. Get ready. We're going to have an orange tree, Isaac. I'm ready, man. I'm ready. I'm ready for I'm the, the succulent, here, delicious then. nectarines that we're going to produce. That's my rod. Um, Oh no, don't do it on here, man. I want that grass. Do it over here. On All our right. on our classic. Uh I got a quick. There you go. Uh, let's also shear if you got a shear there. Let's do this. Get some, oh yeah. Complete that there quest. You go. Nice. Simultaneously. Oh, and then uh anchor it all down. So now we can turn orange leaves into copper nuggets with a 60% chance, but that needs to be under the blood um strainer, right? Yeah. So we yeah. now um, actually, do need to get like. Uh, oh, I didn't say this to extract. That's like why it's not um, blood, right? Well, we need three more copper for a bucket, just generally, right? To get if a bucket. You, if you claim your quest, you get co two copper dust. Oh, let's have a look. If you did, I probably did. I did. Here you go. Nice. Can you smell that copper? That is that the, the deal? It is. I, I would assume so. Yeah, there you go. Oh, only, yeah. uh, nice. only three in there, I guess, but. Uh, oh, we'll, we'll, we'll four in. Why not? Get them okay, cool. That's that's good. That's good. Easy. Easy. Yeah, so I guess a, a bucket of copper. Nice. Take that out. Let's uh, swap that back for this, and then let's just add this here to that filter. We'll do this, and this, so that can extract the tin. Unless the glass bottle method works again? Question mark. I don't think it. I mean, you can try it, man, but I don't think it's going to. So, so I just use it on this blood altar now. Yeah. No, that does have a bucket in. So yeah. All right. Let me make this bucket then. Okay, cool. Good. All right, nice. I'm gonna suck your blood. So we need um, suck your blood up. Yeah, hold on. Let me let me uh, let me let me empty out this so you can get a chance when that next one gets pulled out. You should have space. Uh, while you do that, I'm gonna buy another strainer because again, who who's got time to make strainers when you can just buy them from from our in-game okay. Timu? There we go. So I just there we go. Bucket of blood. Bucket of blood. Bucket of blood. 
Ooh. Yeah, I've got your oh. life essence, Isaac. Be careful. You got my life essence? I've got your life oh essence gosh. in my bucket. Here you go, man. Stick it over this uh, strainer behind the sprayer. There, there we it go. is. And so now if we stick the, the copper, oh, sorry, the orange leaves down here, we do need another strainer, of course. We a never-ending yeah, need for, for meshes. <laughs> Uh, what is the mesh recipe? It's like sticks and, and leafy string. Yes, that's correct. Okay. Gosh, we need so many leaves. And with these leaves, man. Oh, gosh. I hope you don't need this special co copper mesh. Oh, copper. But there is a copper mesh available in the quest line. It's a tier no, two no, mesh. Leaf leafy mesh is good. So I think the I idea see. is that we can use higher tier meshes, and they're probably better, because like the leafy mesh here has 96 uses. The copper tier two mesh has 384 uses. Okay. So it goes way longer. See. I also think though that then there's like there's upgrades you can make. So if you just type in at uh, strainer, there was a bunch of upgrades, like improved mesh upgrade, improved input upgrade, approved output upgrade, and approved duration upgrade. Uh, and then there's like yeah, an upgraded yeah. version of all those. So there's four tiers, right? There's the yellow ones, then the green ones, then the blue ones, then the red ones, right? Mm -hmm. But then there's also these improved everything upgrades at the end of each tier. So you can get like a tier one improved everything upgrade, a tier two improved everything upgrade. And basically the idea is that um, if you press U on one of these meshes, right, and then you go to the upgrades tab at the top, you can see what all of these different upgrades do. And so, like, the improved mesh upgrade, uh, it says mesh damage chance 20%, so it's less likely to take, like, a use every time that you use it. And then there's also the improved input upgrade, which improves the chance that, like, the input won't be used, I think, when you put the leaves in, right. it's, like, improved chance that it doesn't use it. Oh. Then there's the improved output upgrade, which I assume improves the output chance and then finally there's the improved duration upgrade which makes it faster and then if you put in the improved everything upgrade at tier one it will get all of those effects and as you go up it's the same upgrades like four times so the, all the red ones do the same thing all the blue ones do the same thing all the green ones do the same thing all the yellow arrows do the same thing but the higher tiers just do it more right I and so see. the best upgrade to have is the improved everything upgrade like red but to do that you gotta right. go through all the different tiers you gotta craft them all up and all yeah, the top and okay. the improved everything upgrade red is just like the best of all worlds, right? The upgrades of all upgrades. The mother of all upgrades. Exactly. So the the, okay. the, the, the sieve is going to be really fast. It's not going to uh, use your inputs very often. It's not going to use the mesh almost at all. It's going to produce a ton of outputs, right? It's like the best of nice. everything. Yeah. Cool. That's good. Okay. Finally, okay, output is the best see. until everything upgrade. How hard is the improved output upgrade to make? So the improved output upgrade is just four stone, four copper, and a, and a cobblestone. We can probably get that soon-ish. Um, as soon as we yeah. get this first mesh. So let's, uh, Actually, yeah. Because I got three copper. Yeah, so. but I'm about to get more, right? With the nuggets, that's the whole point of. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I got four actually as oh, well. So go. even before we do that, for the data. Uh, so that, you can make you can make the improved output upgrade. I think I can. Let's have a look. Four stone improved four stone. output upgrade. All right. So yes, yeah, so I just need Z stone the cobblestone. So. Here's four colored stone. I think that'll work. Um, Lovely. And then one, two, three, four. Here's four cobblestone. Yeah. Man. Here we go. Got it. Oh, nice. Okay, well, stick it in this uh, blood mesh, man. Okay. You open it up and just stick it in the top left there. Yeah. So now we've got ah, this in. So that's where that's going to improve our, our output chance. It says, what does it say? It says, improved, what color is it? It's yellow. The improved output mesh, it says additional output chance 20%, mesh damage 100%. So it's all the same, but like sometimes we're going to get two instead of one, I think. Oh, it's right. going to. No, no, that's not true. I think. Basically, right now it's a 60% chance. It might go up to 80. Yeah, either 80 or 72, depending yeah, either, on how yeah. they've calculated the 20%. Yeah, game, is it an additive 20% right? or is it a multiplicative 20%? Yeah, either sense. way, it's it's positive. That's uh, true. Which it, is good. It seems additive. We got a lot of saplings there, man. A lot of uh, copper nuggets. Oh, yeah, we've got eight there, oh. didn't we? Which is uh, pretty nice. Almost a full ingot. Almost uh, a full ingot. Here we go. Full I've got, got, got 41 more orange leaves, man. Here we go. Nice. Okay, that should that should definitely give us a good showing. Should hopefully, get like four copper. Yeah, we're getting. Oh, no, I got I got two that, that time. No. We went from ten oh, to twelve. Okay, maybe. Oh. Interesting. Interesting. Maybe it's like twenty percent chance of a second output. I don't, I don't know, know, but like we're getting a lot of them quite regular. Who knows, man? Who knows? Um, anyway. Okay. Oh, man, I, got, I got though. three more copper ingots as well as the quest reward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here yeah, it's nice that you. Um, don't have to smelt this as well. It's just straight up crafting yeah. copper done. Right, don't have to wait for a furnace, which is kind of nice. So, okay, so I've got tin ingot now, and so presumably nice. we do the same with tin. Where if we get 
a tin dust, which we can do by putting that in here. Then the quest thankfully gives us loads of tin dust. I assume we nice. can then make a light gray colored sampling. The light gray colored sampling is going to give us light gray colored leaves. And then my assumption is that we can make tin nuggets yeah, with light gray thing, colored leaves. Basically. Yeah. Exactly yeah okay, so if you nice. claim your quest, then it can get the tin dust. I will. Yeah. If you throw that at me, I will get as. There you go. I need one, but any will do. That's fine. Let's do this. And then over here, we're going to have to set up an area to grow all these trees, man. We need a, we need a bit of space. I'll, I'll, we're getting crazy, oh. man. Couple of me. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to shear a little bit. Just to complete that quest, I guess. And then I'm also going to become a little crooked. A little crooked man. Go and crook those bad boys up. I'm going to crook them, man. Crook them right up. I wonder where the word go. crook comes from, you know? Yeah, do crooks have crooks? Is that why? It's yeah. The, 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 the or do you think it's just because, like, the, is it is it something to do with, like, you know, if you're, um, if you're... Oh, because you're crooked. Crooked, you're like, crooked. You're, yeah, yeah, like, you're, 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 that I don't is know, it. kind of curved in a way that, that your, your, your moral compass is curved? Yeah, your moral com <laughs> compass is crooked. It's distorted, is, is yeah, bent. Yeah, it's, it's bent. Yeah, that's probably, I think that must be it. It must be. And then maybe the same thing applies to the, uh, the, the item as well, right? It's like, you know... Bends all the way around. It's like, oh, that's. It's it's meant to be a rod, but it's crooked. Crook. You say, did you say bends so, all the way around or bends it, all the way around? It bends all the way around. It's like B, -E -N -S. B Ben 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 <laughs> Law. <Lord. laughs> yeah, that's uh, right, Ben. Classic that's bends right. all the way around. <laughs> uh, okay, I need. Uh, you, you can make oh, a big X with regular stone. stone, but you can't make an X. You got to make an X with cobblestone. It's so. a interesting setup oh okay then ben okay ben. okay all right ben we Trying see your spice game, ben. things up i see i see i see yeah, and we'll spice spice things up for us okay here we go so we put these so. in down here and that's gonna get us uh, a bunch of tin and so uh, at that point man once we actually get some some, some tin we can finally start making this uh, this bronze okay. yeah right i'm just looking and we, get that we don't need yeah we don't need how much do we need here for old summon smith Friends. We need the Summon five bronze, right? Five bronze, five yeah. bronze. Which is, uh, I think we said six copper and two tin is going to make us uh, eight bronze. Excellent. I've Excellent. got three copper. How much copper you got, man? Uh, I have no copper on me, oh. actually, unfortunately. Uh, oh. um, yeah, sorry What's about that. that one. Wait, uh, actually, void tin? Any... It's void tin. Oh. Oh, we've got like, we've got to go through a we've got to go through a rigmarole here, man. Wait, oh get... no, it's not it's not just regular ass tin. Wait, do we get void copper nuggets or void copper from the copper nuggets? Hold on, these are oh yeah we do. So the vo the copper nuggets in here, man. If you take those out, the blood it's the not blood, real the blood bath. Yeah, take them out there, craft them into nuggets. I craft them into into in, ingots. Sorry, let's have a go. We can... Oh yeah, they're a bit darker. So are these interchangeable? You got to smelt them. Ah, oh, so I was wrong. You do yeah, have to smelt them. Yeah, you got to take them. the void tin and the void copper, and you got to Fine. smelt the void tin and the void copper. No, sorry, not smelt. You got to put them in the strainer over here. But oh, uh, hold on, do we have what it okay. takes to get another? If you put one of those in, I've got three copper. I think I can make another output booster. Uh, one of these uh, copper nuggets, you say? Yeah, put one okay. of those in. That's gonna get us one copper dust. The copper dust we can use to make uh, bronze. I think I don't think we have to smelt it, but if we want a copper ingot, obviously we have to smelt that first. So You're let right. me do this. There's a few stages here then. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, if All I get... All right. Is it just All one right. cobblestone you need, or do you need four for the upgrade? Um, it it's just, just one, one, I think. Do you have yeah, one? just one. Oh, I do. Here you go. Thank you. Yeah, I think I threw four at you earlier. You did, yeah. You yeah. For, for one. That's fine. Boom, boom. So if I put this in here now if you put the the void copper ingots in it's already a 100 yeah. chance to give you the dust so now presumably it's a 100 and plus percent chance so we should get more than yeah, three copper ingots. My, yeah fingers crossed here we go Let's have a which look. actually makes us pretty useful yeah even if it is a little bit more tedious come okay, on come on come on ben i want to see more come on, come on. ben come it on it says 20 percent. come on come on okay oh. I, got, I got two of these hold on we got, we got two okay, more okay, chances. okay 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 <laughs> Come on, Ben. 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 Oh, ben. Come on, last one. You know you want ben. to. You know you want to. Come on, Ben. Come, Come on. on, Ben. Ben, please. Ben. Ben. ben? Oh, <sighs> fine. I'm, I'm disappointed, Ben. Fine. I actually got 14 ingots uh, as a quest reward, by the way. Um, okay. I've also been lied to. You can't use the uh, the dust. Oh no, we. Uh, oh no, hold on. So it looks like we can just craft three copper dust on one tin dust to make a uh, four bronze dust. Then we can just smelt four bronze dust 
in yeah, that, a that, regular that furnace makes sense. Yeah, because so. it depends what stage of materials you have. Okay, fine, fine. Um, okay, we need more, uh, more, more. Actually, no, this is fine. Actually, I think I, this is fine. Nick, everything's fine. Are we good? Are we good? Good. Um, Good. Oh no, we're not good because I use my tin to make. I use my copper to make this stuff down here, right? So no, we're not good. Yeah, I was going to say right. Okay, more more copper leaves. Yeah, okay, I'm going to in here. Your um, yeah, okay, sweet. Yeah, unfortunately, my quest gave me tin and not copper. I see. Uh, completion. Right. So then we need. I'll look at the other bits. We need some more blood. That's just a quick stabby stabby job. Yeah. Uh, Again, hopefully soon, soon, soon to be done with mobs. Yeah, soon yeah, to be to be abolished. Exactly, uh, abolished. and then we need three void ingots. Uh, ingots. So I got I got some more bonds, which I guess is, is a start. Okay. Good. Uh, we also need more tin. I assume we don't have any other like a, any void tin nuggets or void tin ingots. I've got I've got actual tin. Uh, yeah, it's um. Is that is that all Surprisingly, right? Surprisingly, staggeringly useless, Nick. Oh, I got. <laughs> oh no, I do. I have five void tin nuggets. Actually, that's okay, it was hiding out. Okay. We need, okay, um, need, need the mesh, now, man. Yeah, the mesh. Jesus, gets. it's not. It's not. Uh, they're 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 friggin' fragile old pieces of work, aren't they? Those meshes. Yeah, again, that's why we need the other upgrade. So, like, actually, if you type in, so if you type in improved into JEI, these are all the tier one upgrades we can make. If we can make all four upgrades, we can then craft it into that everything upgrade and we get the right. improved mesh, the improved input, the improved output, and the improved duration. I don't know if that's like plausible for us currently. Yeah, this one needs resource generator too. Electric boogaloo, which requires oh, a lot of crap. Oh, I see. Plays, yeah. Everything yeah. else seems pretty, pretty Everything fine. else is all right. Yeah, 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 I do see that improved input. I guess that's because it's got a chance to not use the input, which is, is very valuable. Yeah, that'd be pretty nice. Because then... The other things are almost, it's multiplicative, right? If it doesn't use the input... And it the, increases the output. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You kind of have a better That's chance true. of things be happening. Right, let me spread out this smelting so we can get this void ingots required for this mob generator. Oh, nice, nice, nice. I got 46 void nuggets, by the way. Here you go. Oh, yeah, give me those then. Yeah, nice. Cool. Uh, excellent. Let me do I'm that. Intrigued. Oh, no, we get four bronze as a quest reward. Of course we do. Oh, beautiful. Look beautiful. at that. Okay, press fine. The same, then. Always Even the case. Better. I've got four the, more. Ben. Right. Uh, so I think we can probably make the summoning block then, right? We just need a, a little of life points. Yeah, if you give yourself, like, one stabby stabby. I've got one good. heart left. Hold on. Give me a second. Okay. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm not quite, not quite at that stage. There we go. Boom. Okay. There you go. All right. Um, good, do you want to pass good, good, good. me the... Um, yeah, here you go, man. Uh, the bronze. That's lovely. The there we go, and let's have a look. So it was the mob. Uh, what was the thing called again? Let's have a look. Summoning block. Summoning block. Summoning block. That's it. Yeah. So Summoning block. Bucket in the middle. Three voiding it to the top, and then a, a, a bucket, like a five. Boom. The bottom. All right. Get ready to summon Isaac. Get so, ready to hold summon. On, let's have a look here. So we do get we got a tin bucket of, of life essence as a reward. The summoning block can be used to spawn some mobs. Press U on the summoning block in JEI to see these mobs. So it looks like. We can, the, the, the one it shows us straight away is using a copper nugget to summon an ender mite. Yeah, so it says okay. void, copper, void copper nuggets can be used on a summoning block with life essence below to summon ender mite. Ender mite from ender pearl fragments. So we need essence below. So if you put it on top of the essence that's here, does that work? Like if you put it next to the sprayer. Like on top uh, of this life essence. Oh, like yeah, okay, the, like this. Can we kind of feed yeah. two birds with one scone here? If we, I mean, I guess the problem now is we can't access that life essence, and I kind of need a void nugget from there. Actually, I've got a void nugget. So if I just do, oh, yeah, look at that, it makes an endermite. Yo, hello, bro. Oh, I well, mean, it is hostile. Um, I do have a sword as well I should use. Yeah, but, I've, got, um, I've got a void knife. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, that will do. I, 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 I made an actual this? sword earlier. But um, interesting. So, like... I mean, that's gonna get us, you know, ender pearls. Oops, sorry, man. Sooner right. Later. Okay. I guess, like, the tricky bit then is getting those over to like the the altar, right? We could probably set up a, a thing where they kind of, I guess it doesn't really work with the void mites because they're so small. But anything else we could spawn that we could summon could be used yeah. with the altar to get to get stuff, right? Points. Summoning. Yeah. Let's have a look. So leather. I'm wondering if there's anything like we can make easily. Carrots we can buy from the store. So something a rabbit <laughs> is doable. Yeah, um, yeah, absolutely. And potatoes. A bone as well. meal is going to summon a skeleton, man. 
Oh, right. there you go then. Yeah, that's going to be quest one complete. 800 years later, man. Excellent. Right, well, I'll get my knife ready again. There we go. There we go. Okay, so if I do this, okay. there we go. You better drop a bone. I know, right? He didn't. What oh, a, what a guy. What a, look at his body just. Look at I this. I know. Frick it out. <laughs> It's ethereal. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, that's okay. I can, we can summon more. It looks like it's kind of... Okay. Nice. The life essence underneath isn't used. Hey. Yay. There you go. Man. Boom. Hey, for the sound of money. Now I got a pumpkin oh. as, a, as, a, as a loot oh, bag wow. reward. You dropped a loot bag and I got a pumpkin, man. Oh, no way. Another good news. If you claim your ender pearl fragments, we should, uh, we should get an ender pearl. Because I need uh, just nine fragments. Yeah. I got, I got, I got three. Eight. Yeah. There you go. That's, the, that's your last. Thank you. Boom. All right. Ender pearl. So the ender pearl can be used. Oh, to, we need four ender pearls to make a green colored sandwich. So we got to kill a lot more of these uh, little jabronis, man. Okay. 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 That's I see how it is. probably fine, though. So like I said before, the tricky space is getting to the, the thing down here. But like, if we just do this. Nope. Oh. Oh, look at that, stuck in the water. Nice. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, if you stand back, if you stand on this side here, I'm gonna keep summoning them, you just knock them into the life essence, okay? Okay. And then once the, once they've all, oh no, okay, they go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> slight, slight loophole. I thought yeah, it would was... work. I thought we'd be able to just throw them all in there. Uh, are, you, are you gonna uh, die? <laughs> I'm gonna die. The good news uh, is they're all after you, man. Like, they don't care about yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, you're all right here. Okay, they're, all, they're, they're dead, they're dead, they're dead. I am on half heart. You got any, uh, you got any fish? Yeah, 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 here you go. Um, oh no, it might be in the chest now. It's in the uh, chest. Yeah, there's six cooked salmon in the bottom right of the Oh yeah, chest. perfect, yeah, I'm just not uh, There okay. we go. How many, better. um, you got any ender pearl fragments, man? I got, I got six fragments, man, I got six fragments. Okay, How many I got do you four, have? that's, I got, that's one more ender pearl. I, uh, I can also do with some more food. Here we go, let me cook some more. Yeah, some I more fish. Go. Um, we could just stick another, another thing in there though, man. So like the fish is, is basically free. Yeah, we just stick a, right. a fishing rod into that strainer. It just creates, creates, it just fish, creates fish. fish. Actually, it's, it's the mesh that's broken again. Surprise, surprise. So, oh, like, mesh-wise, I don't know. Do we need... There, there are four tiers of mesh. Sorry, five tiers of mesh. I think it might be the case that if you want to use the higher tiers of upgrades, so, like, there's... Um, again, if you type in, like, um, uh, mesh upgrade, right? There are five yeah. tiers of mesh upgrade. I think the idea is that if you want to be able to, I, I could be wrong on this, but I think the improved upgrades that we're making, I think can only be used with tier one meshes. I think as you move up, if you want to use like the specialized mesh upgrade and get the, the top tier uh, effects, you need to use a tier five mesh. You okay, know what I, mean? I see. So I, I think see. that's the other so benefit that's... of those higher tier meshes is that they yeah, can use sure, higher tier sure. upgrades to get better stuff, better, better return, returns. Got it. The bamboo mesh. Okay. The bamboo mesh is interesting. Can we get bamboo? We can get bamboo. Oh, no, we need green colored leaves for bamboo, which is what we're uh, working on. So that's upcoming then, basically. Yeah, but bamboo is so easy to grow. And then it's got like 320. It's still tier one mesh, but it's got 320 uses. So it's going to be like, it's like the current mesh we've got, but easier to make. And it's going to last longer, which is, is ideal. Um, for now, though, it looks like we have to go back to back to basics. Yeah, with the, yeah. Uh, with the classic mesh with some sticks, man. There we go. Boom, boom. And boom. this just got more, has more food, so we don't die okay, to the, nice, the nice, mites. Nice to the, yeah. Oh, oh Ben, Ben is in the chat, and he says all upgrades ben. work regardless of mesh tier. Also high. So what's the? Oh. Is, is there a, is there any purpose to the mesh tiers, or are the mesh tiers just to let you know like which tiers, which meshes are better because they've got like more more uses? Is the netherite mesh just tier six because it's got a ton of uses before it breaks? Is that the the logic there? But yeah, just just to stop you from having to replace them. Should we make? Can we make like a bronze sword or something, man? Is that like a? Uh, maybe this is pre looks pretty good though because this is two hit two hit kill. Oh, the the stone sword is two hit kill. Yeah, I oh. think that's just because I've been stabbing them with knives. That's why it took so long. Okay, that's oh, good. That, so I can I go. can put these void nuggets in my offhand like this, and then I can just right click stab. Okay, nice. Yeah, look at this. We got it down to a science, man. Beautiful. Can we hit him? Can we hit him simultaneously? Like if Let's we do like a... Uh... Oh, okay, wait, Oh, missed that one. Let's do three, two, one. Oh, maybe. I think it's only one, you know. Maybe, maybe not. Because I feel like, I feel like I, I, I clicked on him, but... I oh, we, we kind of got That him. might have been simultaneous. Oh no, that was a single one. I got That's 35 shots anyway. Here we go, let me do 
I got nice. I've got I eleven if you need any more, but that's enough, that's isn't all it? Good, yeah, yeah. Nice. Good. All good. One, two, three, four. Nick, I got a green sampling. Oh, man. I'm swimming in the colorful. green. Let's go. Okay, so we can top so this down. Pop this down. Hit it with the stick. You love to see it. And so I meant like a ton of shears earlier. We um oh, yeah, got we got some some work to do. Oh, let's, let's not do it. Yeah, let's not make the same mistake I always make. Let's use the cook <laughs> to get more leaves. <laughs> there we go. Um, okay, good. So then we can use the green leaves to make bamboo over in one of these guys. So if I put this in here, yeah, I'm gonna take the, the I'm gonna we can move the upgrade around. Like the upgrade doesn't have to stay in one mesh. Right? Yeah, so, yeah. Let's stick that in there. Um, I think next on the docket, man. Before we progress any further, we need to make a cave bigger. Yeah, yeah, I suppose so, don't we? So I want a nice big the... wide cave. Unless we're gonna move to like the void dimension. I feel like we need a need a bigger cave. Oh I see it's lost. Let's see what we've got. Let's go small square three by three and I'll excavate this out. Yeah, because that's the thing. You want it to be like a nice shape, right? Yeah, I don't I feel like we do want it to we do want to maintain this kind of blockiness, right? We don't wanna Oh, this might be perfect. Totally random. Kind of. Oh, apparently okay. the um, the concrete in the void dimension is a random color. We just got white. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, that's that. a shame. I wanted something cool. <laughs> Someone in the chat said they got magenta. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, wow. Can you just like grow? Oh, do we need like bone meal to grow the bamboo or something? Or just like grow naturally, maybe? I was hoping we'd have the shift to grow, but we don't. Uh, oh, that's a shame. Yeah, yeah which makes sense because we got the, the, tr the tree whacker, right? Yes. The tree whacker 9000. Oh, but I guess the bamboo's coming in pretty quick on, on that anyway. Um, if I... Does, does the bomb any good with this? This was definitely not oh, yeah. worth it. Like, we would have... This takes so much. <laughs> Ooh, um, okay, okay. Fine. There we go. Okay, so this is not... It does work, it's just not worth it. Okay. Fine. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. Fine, 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 fine. 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 Uh, fine. It's fine. Okay, we can make bamboo meshes now, which is not, not too bad. And they're, they're, they're like okay, quadruple nice, the durability nice. of the other, the other uh, stuff. Oh, that's better, yeah. Um, that's okay, better. I'm going to clear my inventory. I'm going to help you with this um, excavation. So you've gone with yeah. uh, small square small three by tunnel. three. Yeah, small square three by three. And I'm just kind of going this way. I see. Like this? Yeah. yeah, that's it. Yeah, let's make it, you know, a fair bit. There you go. Yeah. Gosh, the oh, pickaxe almost. really. I got the next one. Yeah, it tears through him, doesn't it? Tears through it. Jeez. Thankfully, we've got a lot of wood. Because, like, the wood's not really used for a lot. Yes. Right, we mostly um, use the, uh, the, the leaves. And then the stone pebbles as well. So yeah, you get more stone pebbles to make it more. I'm just going to make a bunch of axes, man. And this. Okay. Yeah, this is better. There we go. Yeah, we should, we should need like a so everything's just kind of crammed yeah, together, is, right? Yeah, this is this is this is shaping up quite nicely. This is good. <laughs> Gosh, yeah, the, the pickaxes they do not last long. Yeah, they, they they really don't. Plus, okay. just having more having more stone around is going to be nice. Here we go. Yeah, this is good. I'll I'll get some torches. Oh, ah, yeah. good. Going here. Got a bit more breathing room now. There we go. Yeah, yeah lots right. Of stone here. Oh, yeah, That's this better. is this is better. A lot better. Way better, way better, so, way better, way so better. It is very high, isn't it? Yeah, it's a little bit hard to kind of pick just, up. Just about. <laughs> <laughs> I do like the high roof. Like, I like having a lot of space Yeah, it's vertically. good for trees as well, right? Yeah, right. No, that is true. And especially if we're so, going to... I guess we do want more trees, right? We want more, like, yeah, more sapling blocks so. to put down more trees, yeah. Ooh. What do I do with them? Um, ooh. Fell into the, fell into the barbecued. The, fell into the pool of blood on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. There we go. Much more breathing room. Much more breathing room. Much excellent. More room. I mean, excellent. I, I feel like it could still do with being a little bit bigger, but you know, we baby steps. Yeah. Yeah. I guess. At least we've got this whole back area now. To, That's true. You know, you can grow trees back here now instead of next to all these campfires. <laughs> In the middle of the base. Yeah. 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 <laughs> No, that's true. Uh, man, I'm gonna make it a bit wider, man. Okay. I'm going. I'm going six more deep. Okay. Just because so it's uh, going... multiple of three. Oh, oh okay. So you're gonna do. Food issue. Hold on. I need to eat. This, I'm, I'm, then. Oh, 
Oh yeah, you're a bit hungry. In fact, I'm getting <laughs> quiet. Someone in the Twitch said, what ship do you guys have in mind? My current ship is uh, Square. <laughs> yeah, Square. I feel like that's in, in keeping with the pack, right? I mean, I guess we could make a different ship eventually, but uh, do we have the, I wonder if we've got RF tools. Do we have the builder? We don't, unfortunately. Ah, uh, shame. 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 Right, yeah, I'm going to make loads of pickaxes too. Let's make yeah. like three of them. I don't want to clog my inventory up too much. Good. Yeah, this is this is much, much nicer. When we come back, yeah. we're going to have so much space. Space, I know. You um, you follow this uh, this 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 whole solo eclipse thing that the the people were going crazy about yesterday? Oh, I watched it live on the news yesterday, actually. Oh, yeah. Um, I've also got family that managed to see it. Um, because I've got family in the USA, so that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, we we apparently like there was supposed to be a bit of it in the UK. <laughs> people were like, you'd be able to it, see it at eight p.m. behind the clouds. Appa like. <laughs> apparently, the weather was so bad that you you just couldn't. Yeah, like, and I was like, that is the most UK thing I've ever what heard. What else is new, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. People were like, it's gonna be a little dark at eight p.m., but you might be able to see it if you look through. The, if the clouds aren't too bad, but yeah, right. Really and the clouds, really... and the clouds were too bad. The clouds yeah, are always bad. That's classic, classic UK um, cloud cloud setup. Yeah, yeah. Um, fun fact, Isaac, the F seven key for the f7 hex mods oh it opens um, the... <laughs> also opens the developer menu <laughs> ben what is this what is what is what is this uh options oh, controls dear. key bindings f7 um <laughs> oh, uh, dear. oh you can't even let's just go light overlay so light overlay is f7 um particle is what's the something else what's the what's the mod called it's um uh, physics? Yeah, physics menu is what you'll type in and then get rid of the F7 there. Oh, I see. Right, okay, let me do that. Jeez. Yeah, physics menu, controls, keybinds, physics. Physics. Oh, yeah, I see that. Right. Get rid of that. Get rid there of that. There we go. Better. Okay. Where's that? Oh, here we go. You made the, you got these one by one draws from earlier. Like, I'm going to start using one of them for stone. That's probably a pretty good idea, actually. Yeah. Yeah, nice. oh, yeah just dump all that stone in there. I've been crafting stuff. it down into, yeah. into. Oh, good, good. Yeah. Just, yeah, there we go. Do the you same. can just press U on the pebble and then shift click and it just puts it in. And it's Beautiful. Easy. There we there go. We go. Oh, we can't open it. <laughs> Please return to <laughs> me. Uh, do we have the. Sh oh, yeah. yeah we're good. We're good. That we go. the side. So yeah, we can open our nice. chest now. Here Lovely. we go. Okay, look, look, look. If you stand over here, look how cramped that little, like, slither of a room that we had <laughs> looked. It's so skinny. Yeah, yeah, that was, pretty, that was pretty rough. We got, we got something to work with now, man. We got something to work with. Yeah, this is Yeah, good. and I feel like we need a much more, like, we need an area for the trees. We need an area for the blood altar. Yeah. An area yeah. for, like, chests and storage. Uh, we can leave. Look at this. Like, when I dug out behind here, just. Uh. <laughs> this is extra growing room for the alloy killed, okay? <laughs> for when he gets even bigger. Now the, yeah, the master note up here makes no sense. It's just floating in the sky. Yeah, just chilling up there. Oh, well. <laughs> Nick. Anyway, Nick, I'm going to claim my quest rewards here real quick. Oh, I'm going to the same. Yeah, nice. Got some coins. So next time we'll come back, we'll, we'll keep pushing forward here. It looks like we've got some uh, some clusters. It looks like we are going to get into uh, Lapis and Redstone, which might be made differently. Mm. I see Budding Lapis and Budding Redstone. Oh, and then a okay. Lapis Stone Alloy, and then there's like a Thermal Shard and a Lava Motron. A Lava Motron is down there. Oh. Okay. Can be configured to produce either Thermal Shards or Lava. Look at that. Flipping egg. And then... Um, yeah, hopefully we can try and use our uh, new mobomatic summoning block to uh, to, to get yeah, some use out of the, the sacrificial dagger as well. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is shipping up quite nicely, man. I like the, I like is, the, the variety. It? Yeah, it's very different to some of the other uh, other Ben packs we played in, in the past. Yeah, it's, it's nice. Love it, Nick. But unfortunately, Nick, we are out of time for this episode of Stonopolis. Stonopolis.